Hello viewers, hope you are doing well. Welcome to this video. In the previous video, I have implemented the functionality of approve answers to the questions. In this video, we will see how can we get the details of approve answer from the backend. So let's get started. So first of all, let me add here the property in our question DTO. Private boolean approved has approved answer is by default is equals to false. So you can see here the API. Let me open the question controller. And here you can see the API that is get question by ID. Let me open the implementation of this API. And here you can see. But with this API, we are getting the question by ID with the list of the answers. Okay. So here, let me give you the space and here we need to check if answer is approved, then here we need to So here in the statement we need to check answer is approved and then we need to set has approved answer that is true and here you can see in the property i have initialized it with false okay so let me go to our answer entity and here you can see in the previous video i have added here the property that is private boolean approved by default false so we also need to Call here answer DTO dot set approved and here we need to pass approved to get the updated record from our database. Okay. So let's run the application. There you can see application is upon 8080. Let's go to our UI and let me open here the inspect to get the results that we got from our backend. So let me refresh the component. And you can see we got the response from our backend. And now you can see the value that has approved answer is equals to true. And in the answer detail list, let me open here the answer that is approved true. The first answer, the second answer that is approved value is false. Okay. So let's show the details into our UI. So let me close this and let me add the code into our HTML. So the code is mat icon that is a check circle. We need to we need to show this a uh, circle green when the answer is approved otherwise not okay so here we need to check steric ng if that is answer dot approved okay we also need to add this property into our scss code that is color green. So let's go to our UI and here you can see the check circle is showing to this answer only. So we need to disable this button when we are getting an approved answer from the backend. So here in the in this spam we need to check that is steric ng if let me open it the inspect 
and let's see what is the variable name that we got from our backend let me refresh the component let me copy this variable name that is has approved answer and here we need to check with not that is question dot has approved answer we need to show this button only when the has approved answer value is false so let me scroll down and you can see the button is disappeared from the list of the answers okay uh, let's let's post another question which is most successfully. So let's go to our this question. Let me click on this and you can see for now there is no answer. So let me log in another user. Let's post the answer to this question. So let me write here. Let me choose the file. Okay, post answer. And you can see answer posted successfully. Let me open again the dashboard. And you can see, okay. So let's back to our. let me click on this question and you can see it's showing here that is approve answer button to this question if i'm clicking on this button and you can see let me refresh the component and you can see okay that is a check circle of this answer okay so that's all for now from my side if you have any vision you can document and also subscribe to my channel for more videos and hit the bell icon. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.